Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're in Royal High, and I came up with an outfit hack. It's the Dear Dolly Bow and the Dragging Train Rose Skirt. So today I'm doing kind of an older trend. I'm doing the paperclip challenge. Um, let me say, if you are doing the paperclip challenge for fun, I would definitely suggest, um maybe not doing it or like writing down the value of every single item in the game because there were a lot of times where somebody gave me something and then i went into the shop and it turns out that it was not really worth anything and i had gone from like a value of six thousand diamonds to a value of like one thousand diamonds and so those were the parts that really set me back and I did end up um, stopping, and I did not get what I needed, unfortunately. Which is a parasol or a halo, so, you know. Of course, we couldn't get that. Because, you know, I, uh, I have a lot of trouble with these. I've actually tried this a couple times before. Once on my own time, and once for YouTube, but the footage got lost um i don't know where it went and i don't really know how the footage can get lost on a phone but i mean it did so yeah and i actually have a couple of shout outs in this video we haven't had shout outs on my channel yet not really something that we do around here but you know, you know we we did it this time so here is our first shout out um actually wait no i don't oh yes this is the first shout out so this is for her youtube channel um i actually asked her and it is muse and pango m-u-u-s-e space and space p-e-n-g-o so make sure you go and subscribe to her because she was super nice to me she gave me an offer and it was a pretty good one she gave me the Falling Spring Blossoms as well as 7,000 Diamonds, which was a little bit of an upgrade, so it was a good offer. And then here's where everything went awful. So I put in the Spring Blossoms and 7,000 Diamonds, and this girl put in those wings. Um, I went to check the value of the wings, and it turns out they were... 1,250, so I went from a value of about 8,000 diamonds to a value of 1,250, so that was probably the worst setback of the game, as well as the fact that nobody really wanted those wings, because, yeah. And then I offered them to one girl, she was kind of rude, I think I, I don't know if it, if it was this girl, but I was in the middle of saying something, and no, it wasn't that girl. <laughs> it was hers that was the girl who traded me the same thing for the same that, for the same thing but some girl in this server i gave the um wings to and i was gonna say and she showed it to me and she was like yeah and i and then i was trying to type i was in the middle of typing and she just declined and you cannot use the excuse oh well i didn't know you were typing because it will literally tell you if somebody is typing in the uh trading so you cannot use that excuse sorry i think it was this girl i gave her my offer oh no it wasn't this girl it was some other girl maybe we already passed her but yeah like don't do that because that's annoying that's probably one of my least favorite parts of trading is the rude people like not a lot of people are scammers they're just really rude and I don't enjoy them at all. They're really mean. And, yeah. I'm disappointed with them. So, I don't do that. Please don't do that. Just, it's so annoying. And I know that a lot of people who do it, like, one time I was trading with someone, and this girl was like, Why did you decline my trade? I was in the middle of typing something. And so then I sent her a trade request, 
the girl who didn't know who had been typing and the girl stopped on her and then I so I, she was trading me and then she declined while I was in the middle of typing and I was like yo you declined in the middle of typing and she was like okay and and I was like you're literally so, you it, that's a you're a complete hypocrite this girl was also really weird. I gave her my offer, and she was like, I'm selling my heels. And then I was like, that's your offer? And she was like, yeah, no. And so then she, I was like, did you even read what I said? And then she was like, yeah, no. So then I s did it again. And then she was like, and she just declined. So then I was like, lol, rude. This girl was also kind of weird, I think. Oh, no, she, this was the girl who just, like, wasn't talking. She just put a thousand diamonds in. And then I asked her if she saw what I said. And I was like, she was like, no. So I says, okay, here. And then I told her, what I had my thing say was, hi, I hope you're having a nice day. I'm doing the paperclip challenge for YouTube. My YouTube, my channel is Emoji Wolf, because I forgot the eye in life. Emoji Wolf Gaming. <laughs> Do you have an offer for this? So that's what I said. You can just do something like that. Then I was trying to click on Felipe, but it wouldn't let me click on Felipe. And I was really sad because I just wanted to trade with Felipe. <laughs> oh my gosh, I just saw Ken. I never even noticed that. Wow. So then I came in here, and here is the server where we have another shout out. I have a girl who was really nice. It's not a YouTube shout out, but just someone who was really nice. And so then this girl said she didn't have an offer, so I was like, okay. And then this girl was like, hi. I told her what I was doing. And then she was like, oh, okay, sure. So then she added something. And she asked if wings were okay, and I said, yeah. And then... We go back to the dreaded, and I was a little scared. I was like, uh huh. And then she added those, and I was like, oh, they're kind of old. I don't know how much they're worth. Uh, I'm just going to go with it, because I don't really know. Turns out it was only like 5,000 diamond of a downgrade. Oh, no, it was like a 2,000 upgrade. Never mind. <laughs> So, yeah, then this girl finally traded me, and then I asked her my thing, and I put in the stuff, and she goes, do you have Star Fry Scepter? And she had said, um, do you have the Star Fry Scepter, you know, just before I offer, like she was gonna actually give me an offer? So then I was like, yeah, no, I don't have a, sorry. And then she was like, okay, I don't have an offer then. Uh, so that was another root girl. And then here's one who, another one who cut me off while I was typing. Another very rude one. I uh, don't like her either. Don't report any of these people because, like, just being rude is not a reason to report them. Unless they're, like, absolutely bullying you and, like, telling you to kill yourself. Self, then you can go report them, but, like. You know, whatever. So then this girl did this trade. It was a little bit of an upgrade. I think, like, by 500. Then this, this is my favorite girl, probably, out of the entire video. She was so sweet. I told her what I was doing, and she was like, OMG, what channel? So I tried to tell her, although it tagged out. So I kind of had to tell her um, in a different form. And... Later, she said she was going to subscribe, and she did actually subscribe. I went and I looked. If she hadn't actually subscribed and I would just lied, I would not give her a shout-out. I would just kind of, I would probably tell, say, like, yeah, this girl kind of lied to me, but, you know, it's fine. She still gave me an offer, so it's okay. I'm not too bothered by it, but she actually subscribed to me, so I'm going to say some really nice things about her. She was so nice, and she was so sweet, and her outfit was really nice, and she was, like, she was saying that she wouldn't have a good offer because she was poor. And then it was, she was like, 
he okay and so then she put in the skirt and i was like yeah that's pretty good and even if it was underpaying i really wouldn't care because she was just so so nice to me and then i came over here she talked to me i was like thank you and she was she told me i was so awesome and then she was like let me sub right now and so then she did she stood there for a second and then she said that she was done and i was so happy and then she left and this other girl also asked me for the star frost scepter but no she asked me for the high school lacy boots uh and i had already gotten rid of them unfortunately so yeah then i looked and turns out the cottage skirt is actually getting reworked so you know kind of need to buy that again because i did get rid of it i think yeah i did yeah, I kept trading after this, so I did get rid of it, so I need to buy it again, because it's going to be reworked and more expensive in, like, I think two days. And then she friended me. So, yeah, make sure you go buy the Cottage Princess skirt now, because it's going to be reworked in, like, two days. And it, I don't know if it's going to be off sale, but I know it will be more expensive. So do go buy that soon. I am freaking out, because it's so pretty. If you haven't seen the tweets, it's really, really beautiful, and I'm really, really excited then it took me forever to get rid of these two things like i spent probably like i spent so long trying to get rid of these and even though in the video it's only oh wait never mind <laughs> i thought i a lot of these i thought i spent so long trying to get rid of but i guess not um this is the part where i stopped because i had tried so hard and everything i just went so far down on that trade and i had gone so far down on other trades and it was just tiring i'd been on here for about an hour and it was getting kind of annoying so yeah <laughs>